welcome to my other video so before starting this video i would like to thank all my viewers and subscribers who have supported me all these days i keep getting mails and messages asking me to give more skincare tips and hair care tips so here i am so in today's video i'm going to show you how to make your own hair oil for hair growth and for damaged hair and it can be used for treating dandruff as well in this oil the main ingredient i'm going to use is aloe vera as you all know it has so many good qualities in it so let's get started so you will need fresh aloe vera leaf here i have taken a big one and i've cut into two pieces I've taken a fresh aloe vera from our garden. And then you need some curry leaves. Mm, this is one or two finely cut small onions and a few peppercorns. And then you'll need coconut oil. So I'm going to cut the two edges of the leaf. So guys, for the preparation of the oil, we have to first extract the juice from the aloe vera and then comes the heating part. So I'll show you how to do that. So now I'm going to cut into small cubes. Here I'm using both the skin and the gel as well. You'll be thinking why I'm using the skin. Because aloe vera skin has antibacterial properties and it's used for itchy scalp and it can be used for treatment of dandruff as well. So as you can see I have cut into small cubes and now I'm going to add a few curry leaves. If you don't have curry leaves then that doesn't matter. Next is blending it really well. I'll blend it and I'll be right back. So this is how it looks like. As you can see, it has a watery and a green color to it. And now I'm going to strain it in a strainer. So this is going to be a little time consuming process, but be patient. As you can see, we have separated the juice. We just need the juice part for the preparation of the oil. I'm going to throw away the remaining part of it. So this is the second step. Here I have heated the pan in high flame and now I'm going to reduce the aloe vera juice. So you have to keep on stirring it really well so that it has to be reduced in half of its quantity. So 
so as you can see it has reduced to half of its quantity and now it's time to add the coconut oil here I have taken equal quantity of coconut oil and the reduced aloe vera juice and keep on stirring it really well So at this point I'm going to add the cut onions and few peppercorns and you can stir it for about one minute. So as you can see the onions has been little bit light brown so that is the time to off the heat. So finally the oil should look like this. As you can see it has a lovely green color to it and the onions has been lightly brown color. Isn't it so lovely? See you soon guys, until then it's me signing off, bye bye!